Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. What I was telling y'all before was the butters that came like this, it had a hole in it. So the whole wrap that is wrapped around was filled with butter. So I had to get that out of there. And then, too, I don't know about y'all, but I love me some. Ooh, I love me some garlic butter. So I had to add some garlic to it a little bit. Because these crabs from up north, so they don't really know how to get down with get down like down south. So I got my scissors. I don't even know why I got these scissors over here, but I got them. I got these scissors. Gotta have you a cracker. And we finna get the crack in. So, y'all, these babies. I'm just so excited. <laughs> my mother got me. Yes, ma'am. We in the car. How do you send me this picture like that? <laughs> Don't they look good? <laughs> Where you at? I'm wrong. This company reached out and wanted me to do a um video for them. These crabs from up north. From Maryland. They shipped them from Maryland. Yeah, my family, we love crabs. Blue crabs. So I live in Atlanta. Nobody really sell blue crabs like that because we not buying no water for real. So we would go to Savannah and get them because you know Savannah is like about an ocean kind of sort of. Well, but to drive four hours for crabs, it be a lot. And then sometimes Savannah prices be tripping. But you need to get your crabs and be like, what the fuck? Good. But. I ain't gonna cap those. Savannah crabs be good. They be good. Good to put. Snow crabs good. They are. Right. But blue crabs, the meat is so much richer. Like, it's real meat. It's real freaking meat. Like, real meat. I really love this shit. And my mama's out of family. Very friends with Savannah. So, when I was down there for school and shit, like, this was all I would eat. Like, they would kind of up to our cookouts and be like, we're gonna eat oysters and crab? Like, hell yeah, that's what a cookout look like to us. I mean, y'all gonna have hot dogs and shit for the kids, but the rule, if you don't know how to eat crab, you can't sit at the table. You can't sit at the table. Like, and yeah, in Savannah, they make their own special kind of butter each, like, each market make their own type of butter. So it just it just be hitting on hitting, like it just be hitting. It really just be hitting. Oh y'all need to see me dip it in the butter. Let me let me bring it in. You gotta dip it, dip it. Yes, I got this big ass thing of butter. It's that serious. You think my crab is out? What? What? Oh. I don't know. Good job, baby. It's out. And go ahead and in. You see how thick this meat is? Oh my god. Boo crab so good. You can eat these bitches hot or cold. So, we're just leading me into my next topic of by stepping up my game, meaning y'all gonna get better ass content. Starting with this mukbang, so I'm not gonna lie to you. The kid was finna just eat. <laughs> <laughs> and not think twice about y'all. <laughs> but I said, you know what, no. I want y'all to fuck with me, let me fuck with y'all. I'm putting out in the universe what I want so I can receive it. The grab place. The only thing I would say though about these crabs, their seasoning is not the best. I want to get them to send me some more. I'm going to um, probably not do no seasoning on them. That way I can season them myself. Or, or what if y'all, what if we do a cook with me video and we make them? Oh, that means we're going to have these shits delivered live. 
Daddy, what you think? Oh, yeah, he just knocked out. He probably using my my voice as noise to go to sleep. He is over there snoring. Y'all, Daddy do this every time. We say we're going to drink on our off days. We're going to kick shit. We're going to parlay. I say I'm going to bed. Once I get, like, there, I'm going to go to bed. Either we finna cook or I'm finna go to bed. He wanna keep drinking. He wanna stay up. Now you finna sleep his whole Saturday away. Mom. I don't understand. I didn't even know you could ship food. I used to have um, this girl group that I had started from when we was all going live on Bigo together. Oh yeah. We used to always talk and shit. So, like, when we was on FaceTime, we used to cook and do everything. It was kind of like, girl, man, that plate will be all in different states. Now that shit legit, like, I'm just gonna be like, nah, I'll be for real, mail me a plate. <laughs> I don't know. I done had so many encounters with people that I did consider as friends. I'm just no nonsense. Like, if I gotta explain shit to you, I don't want to deal with you. I really don't. I'm just like, if you thought that shit through and still chose to do that shit, that shows who you are. And sometimes, Sometimes you just don't want to be associated with certain shit. Like, like my video. I'm a true Capricorn. Like, damn, I hate that one too. Oh, y'all got some other seafood seasoning. Let me grab it. Hold on. I didn't realize how big that box was. Okay. So, um, oh, this is my seafood, my other seafood seasoning. It's mouth seasoning from this place that I love to go to all the freaking time called New Orleans Seafood. They yeah, just took me there the other day. Do y'all like boiled eggs? Oh, yeah. Um, do y'all like boiled eggs with y'all seafood? Uh, shout out to my little brother. He had put me on. He like, what? You, you go to the seafood spot and don't get the eggs? I'm like, what? I'm not going to no seafood spot just to get some goddamn eggs? That is crazy. I tried it though. Mm -hmm. Look at this. Do y'all see all this? All of this is meat. Even this hanging. Meat. Pure crab meat. Dunk it. Right? Dip it. Tell me how many influencers did a seafood butt bang with just blue crabs. I'll wait. Mmm. 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 Mm. See? All that. Mm. With me. Alright, so content to look forward to that I'm excited about. I want to get into I want to get more into oh, let's try with this better. I want to get more into modeling. Um, I want to be the everything girl. Like, what? You model? You dance? You act? Yeah. 
I'll be above. What do you want me? <laughs> like, I want to be. I want to be able to do everything. I'm a busybody. For Mother's Day, the actual day of Mother's Day, Bay's idea was to give me nothing to do, to just kick shit. Y'all. They butter, this butter tastes better. Y'all. I love the gesture. Like, he cleaned up the house, washed clothes. It was so sweet. Like, daddy was sweating all fucking day. But I was fucking bored. Bored on my motherfucking mind. Bored on my motherfucking mind. So, I realized, like, I'm a homebody. And I got into YouTube and TikTok because. I really don't like to be out too much like that for real, but TikTok and YouTube allows me to like have shit to do without really like having shit to do. Cause I can make a video now like I'm doing with y'all. I probably won't edit this video till probably after I come back from the cookout, depending on how drunk we get. Or probably early in the morning tomorrow for y'all for it to drop. And then, I was gonna record my day tomorrow because daddy got his dates mixed up. He had stuff planned for me for Mother's Day, but the tickets that he had for the stuff that I was supposed to do wasn't until this weekend is when they had availability. So my video gonna be hella late, but it's coming. Now, my Mother's Day video. And um, this is Loki, a Mother's Day gift from him. I just love to make sure that not only do I look good, but everybody around me looks good. That's just who I am. That's why I'm very choosy about who I allow around me. Yeah. It's no, there is no, in between with me. Either I like you and you know it, or I don't fuck with you and you can tell. <laughs> like, that's just how I am. I don't even know if you guys should on purpose. You ate them all. Last night. Yeah, you ate them all. You said I can't get you. You for you. Yeah, but I haven't left the house, Tyrese. And stop interrupting my video. Bye. I really don't be trying to do that shit on purpose. It just be like, I don't like you. <laughs> Sorry. But I don't like you. And I'm learning as I get older. The saying, fake it till you make it. But it's like, why? <laughs> I don't need you that goddamn bad. Like, you're not helping me make millions, you ain't. Pleasing me sexually, you ain't really doing that for real. But getting on my motherfucking nerves with your presence. So again, why are you here? Like that just that just be how I be feeling. <laughs> that just be how I be feeling. And baby, like you so mean. You know what's crazy? Me and him. Me and him. We're the same in so many ways, but to the public, we're total opposites. No opposites. He looks unapproachable, but probably is the most, the easiest one to approach. I look approachable, but don't approach me. <laughs> like, oh God. He will talk to you and give you good conversation. I'm walking away because I don't know you. I mean, but, and I, and I'm not saying that because I'm mean and I'm like, oh, oh I'm a celebrity, da 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 da. Honestly, y'all, I'm shy as fuck. I am awkward and quirk and quirky and like easy going. Like, I just don't talk to everybody. I've been like, that's such a little girl. Like, I'm gonna like, that's about the little girl to myself. Spoke when spoken to, like, 
that's just how I've been. But being in, oh, these crab legs always bring out next. Um, that's the only downside about seafood. When you eating crab, blue crabs, or even like snow crabs, they bring gnats. I don't know if they smell them. Mm, no, literally. And so when we eat these shit outside, oh my god, the worst place to eat crab. The worst. But yeah, I don't really be like trying to be anti-social. I just am anti-social. But being in this influencing thing, I'm learning that that might not be the best route. Because I do have people that like walk up to me. Like, I've had folks walk up in. Me and Bay had an inside joke for the longest. The next person that walk up to you, but no matter where we at, smile and talk to them. I'm like, for oh, what? What am I gonna say? Did you watch my last video? Like, I don't know what to say to them people. And to my fans, I should say now. Like, I did not know. I'm like, these people. Oh. <laughs> so, now, well, I'm good now. I'm getting comfortable with it now. But. Even now, though, like, it comes time where, ooh, you know these bitches spicy my nose on. It just comes to a point where it's time for me to get out of my fucking comfort zone. I can't keep taking the easy way out. And that's why I'm telling you guys, like, it's time to LA. I've been auditioning for shows, re-auditioning for some of them. If you know, then you know. So, fingers crossed for that. I'm definitely going to bring y'all along on the journey this go around. Because we're making it all the way to the fucking show. My last vlog or last like video is gonna be the last video y'all see before I be like, <laughs> am I professional? And <laughs> when we made it, <laughs> no, I'm I'm shy of strangers, but once I get to know you and I'm comfortable, you gonna tell me to shut the fuck up? Shut the fuck up! <laughs> like daddy was that. Daddy said I talk too much. But he's my confidant. And the only person that I really feel genuinely at times able to talk to. It just depends on the topic. But over the past years, I'm learning to everybody does not need to know everything. And that includes like friends, spouse, parents. Everybody doesn't need to know everything. Oh yeah. We really been doing this video for well, give or take 10, 20, like 20 minutes, cause I had to set up everything. I'm probably not gonna eat this whole box today. But I'm definitely going to try to eat it before Monday. For one, once you get seafood and dirty cooked, you can't keep it that long. Um, and for two, I got to go back to work on Monday. And to try to eat these and take calls, it's going to be a headache. So you see how much work it takes. But. Yeah, y'all. Like, that's what I've been up to. That's where I'm at in life. This is where I'm at in life. And I love y'all for rocking with me. Because I am the most inconsistent YouTuber I know. <laughs> but I will become the best YouTuber. Y'all know. See how I did that right there? Ah! I gotta watch Missy Monday. So let me tell y'all who my favorite YouTubers are. So my favorite YouTubers are, of course, Dear hands down. I actually like her now more than I liked her when she was a couple. No, no shame. <laughs> She's better. 
she's really her authentic self now. It really felt like looking at her now and then knowing like where she started at. Kim was holding her back. <laughs> Kim was holding her to fuck back. I don't know, he was somewhere sick like Chris Sale. That leads me to my next. On YouTube that I like now too. That I didn't really care for when she was in a relationship. What a relationship she was in. Queen. I was not a fan of Queen when she was with Chris. It just, they just seemed forced. Like, it was more than meets the eye. You know how you're talking to a friend and you like, it's something you ain't telling me. But okay. That's how I felt with them. That's how I felt with them. And then when she got cool with like, Perfect Glass, I ain't really like her too much. I feel like I'm really careful. Um, my next favorite YouTuber, Goddamn Zo. I ain't gonna lie though. I really love him for his messy Mondays. I really don't watch nothing else outside of that. I mean, he's been on like platforms, live platforms like Bigo. I don't call him live. No, I, I only call him live on Bigo. Oh no, on Instagram. I don't call him live on Instagram. Um, he's funny as fuck. Like. He just is who he is. <laughs> and like now I be seeing him on commercials and he be looking the same way he be looking on live. It's just like, it's just so iconic. Cause it's like, you didn't change, you didn't switch up. You still are true to you. So, him, what's it? Dear Queen. Goddamn Zoe. I think them YouTubers that I would like watch. Oh, Neek. Neek. I love Neek. Like, she's dope as fuck. And she's a fellow Capricorn, so. It just makes sense. I'm not gonna lie though. Her and King, I wish they would've worked it out. If they could've. Cause I don't want nobody to be nothing and not be true truly happy i really feel like they could have worked it out though they were dope together like that was a couple i really would have liked to see get married and go all the way like and they are so cute she's supposed to be with some dude now i don't really know too much about him i don't know and i'm not really watching the video that include him. So, I don't know. But, Nika definitely bad it up. She's cool. She seems really, really cool down to earth. Um, who else do I like to watch? But there really ain't too many. Oh, Alicia Marie, definitely. I fucking love her. She was why I started YouTube, actually. Like, she is one of the reasons why I started YouTube. And I used to tell myself when I started that I was gonna be the black version of her. <laughs> but, there's so much that goes into YouTube that nobody talks about. And nobody wants to assist with. Like, it's a lot. YouTube is a lot. It definitely is a career. It definitely is a career. So, I'm about to make it my career. Everything is content. Including this cookout. <laughs> After I'm done eating, I'm gonna start vlogging. But I'm gonna vlog from plus size edition perspective. Because the whole family gonna take it out. Y'all, it's so challenging sometimes to like, okay, I'm gonna do this video for my page. 
this video is gonna be for our page. But I'm gonna get the hang of it. The more I keep doing it, the better I get. But you gotta, you gotta keep doing it. That's the only way you gonna get better. You gotta keep doing it. Oh, y'all, this video is gonna be so much to edit. This shit is almost two hours. Looks like I get to the bottom. Many bitches got spicy. Alright y'all, I'm not done with these. Mm -hmm. Ooh, my mouth, I need a break. I'm out getting hot. And I'm finna do this break. So make sure you follow us on Plus Size Edition. Oh, you love me feel. Mm -hmm. Why what's over there too if you like family oriented activities? Mm -hmm. I think I got a good idea. I got a really good idea. Alright you guys, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I got seven crabs left out of 12 because I ordered a dozen. I am full. Shout out to the crab place. I definitely am going to go, I'm going to run this back and get them raw so I can cook them myself. But that was pretty good. It was really, really pretty good. And I'm super, super excited. Um, I'm probably gonna do a thumbnail after I put my lashes on. I'll take this one it off. But Ooh. Okay. Mmm. Thank you, Kirby Kitty, for rocking with me. And I hope you enjoyed this mukbang, eating blue crabs with Marie. Me. Make sure you hit the subscribe button so you never miss another fucking video. And I love you, Kirby Cutie. If you don't stay the fuck, Kirby and cute food, we will. Okay? Okay? I love you until next time. Peace.